Welcome to Consecration Day 19. My name is Wes Giffen from Most Blessed Sacrament Parish. Today's reflection centers around the gospel story of the rich young man. In this story, uh, a young man goes up to Jesus and says, Teacher, what good must I do to gain eternal life? This is actually the central question in all of moral theology. And um, what is Jesus' response? It's, Go, sell all your possessions. Now, like, what are possessions? Possessions are, are things that we control, that we have dominion over, that focus ourselves inward on us and our own needs. Now, I want to contrast this with you with gift. And what are, what are gifts? Gifts are, are very similar to possessions. However, gifts um, are focus our attention outward. They focus our attention on the heart of the other. When I have a gift, when I've been given something um, as, and I accept it as gift, it, every time I see that gift, it should remind me of the person who gave it. So in a sense, gifts connect us with the heart of another person. And uh, if we contrast this back to possession, possessions um, in a sense do the exact opposite. They cut off um, our relationships with the outside world they focus our attention solely on us, and they invoke things like pride and gratitude and stinginess, while gifts invoke beautiful virtues such as gratitude, generosity, um, humility, and charity. And so if we are to imitate Christ, if we are to put on the heart of Christ, um, who emptied himself, came in the form of a slave, um, how can we do that if we are just full of stuff I mean, possessions take up our time, our energy, but also our, um, our mental space, our physical space, our emotional space, and our spiritual space. So I encourage you to truly put on the heart of gratitude by relinquishing control over the various possessions in our lives and, and truly accept all as gift, all as a beautiful gift of God. Um, and was, this is like the good, the bad, the ugly, the indifferent, all of it as gift. And, 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 and truly give it and share it with the rest of creation. Um, and so when we do this, we can really understand the answer of that question, what, what good must I do? It's give. give. Give of yourself. But not only give your stuff, give, give your time, your attention, your focus, your skills, your love. Give it all for the sake of the other. Give the good away for the good of the other. Thank you. Keep up the fight. And uh, Our Lady, the Immaculata, pray for us. Maria.